This is a new it's a five inch uh, display, and even then, it's lighter than the previous one. Yeah. And you can drop it. I can drop it, yeah, it's designed to be uh, dropped. Wow. <laughs> and that he does it with that confidence. <laughs> well, we've been dropping them uh, quite. Uh, it's been designed to survive a six, sorry, <laughs> a, a really six, uh, a six feet drop, which is basically this, yeah. uh, extensively. Yeah. And uh, we've been testing it extensively. I've never seen a crack display so far. So it's been designed with, with that in mind. Without having that, it's not a, a ruggedized device, which is cumbersome and, and very nasty. But for the user, it's just a, a very standard form factor. It's slightly thicker than what you see normally, but you don't need to add an additional case. So most people yeah. just put in an additional case because the phone is just badly designed because it needs additional protection the moment you take it out of the box. And you can take it apart, actually. So you see the, the battery is basically removable, which is now a, 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 a so sellable well. feature, yeah. interesting enough. And the other thing that we're doing it's basically ensuring that um, the user can repair his phone as easily as possible. So basically, I've just swapped away the display, which is uh, the part that breaks the most. Um, about one third of all smartphones will suffer an accident in the first two years of their life. Half of those are basically broken screen. For example, the user could upgrade his camera module uh, later when there's new um, upgraded versions available or new functionality. We could think about and having an infrared camera, just snap it on and just replace it, things like that.